Episode one, Chef Ecrib, let's get this bread. Dad, okay, that was cringy. What's up guys, Ecrib here, and today we're gonna be doing something very special. Chef Ecrib, I've been wanting to do this for a while. Uh, I'm gonna be doing something with G Fuel, as you guys know what G Fuel is, it is the best thing ever possible in this world to ever exist besides my streams and me as the content creator, Ego. Anyway, just kidding, just kidding, but G Fuel guys, Hashtag code eager. Hashtag, hashtag, hashtag code eager. Hashtag code eager. Alright, but for guys, what we are going to do today is something very simply easy. What you're gonna need is G Fuel, ice tray, some toothpicks. All you need. Bada bit bam, boom, and done. Alright, done, simple, easy, complete. What I'm gonna need for you guys is make sure you check me out on Snapchat, Twitch, YouTube, all that, Instagram, ECRYB. Anyway, quick plug, here we go. So guys, the very first thing you need to do is you need to make your G Fuel, obviously, okay? If you don't make your G Fuel, you're lazy bum. But we already have some pre-made blueberry chug rug right here and the uh, dolphin shaker from G Fuel. So gosh darn sexy. Then we got some uh, cotton candy water bottles. I was too lazy to use another shaker. Once you have your G Fuel prepared, start pouring into your ice tray. Now that you have finished pouring in your G Fuel into your ice cube tray, easiest step right here. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. You're gonna wanna open your freezer, okay? Open it up. Put your ice tray, this right here, put the ice tray, ah, right in your freezer. Don't look at what I have, you perverts. Now that you put the tray of G Fuel into the freezer, wait about 25 minutes for the G Fuel to semi-freeze, not fully freeze through, because you need to put the toothpicks into the ice cubes. So we can stand and we can, you know, eat it as like a popsicle. 12 seconds later. Two very boring minutes later. Also guys, if you wanna cop some E-Crib merch, check it out. The grind never stops, we out here. Ecrib.spreadshirt.com About half an hour later, guys, you can tell that the uh, ice cubes are not fully frozen. They're semi-frozen. They're still liquidy under that uh, soft layer. So now all you gotta do is just put in the toothpicks. Beautiful. Now, Put these bad boys back in the freezer until they fully freeze. Mm -mm -mm. Delicious. One hour later. All right guys, it's been about an hour, so let's see if our G Fuel popsicles are done. Here we go. Ooh, they look delicious. Ah, ooh, a little hot, here we go. Ah, ah, ah. Ooh wee, they look delicious. Guys, come here, come check this out. Now that they're done, guys, give them a little crack so we can get them out. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's that cotton candy. Let's give it a lick. Oh. Oh. So good. Oh. Mmm. Brain great. Oh. Finished product, guys. I'm glad you enjoyed this episode of Chef. Time, what did I call Cooking with the no, Chef, Chef E Crib, episode one. That, and that will be the first episode of Chef E Crib. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to follow, smash that like button, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Shout out to G Fuel for hooking me up because I paid for it. But if you want to hook me up, G Fuel, let me know. Glad to be here. Honestly, it's it's popsicles. It's not that hard, guys. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you had a fun time watching it. Been a boy, you guys, and I'll see you in the next one. Deuce. <laughs>